today I'm going to be showing you how to dissect imaginal discs from third instar Drosophila larvae. Third instar larval discs uh, can be used for a number of developmental um, processes. Uh, we look at them in our lab uh, to see uh, the process of apoptosis, um, but you can express uh, various proteins in them and study them that way and uh, see all sorts of developmental processes going on within the discs. Um, in, order to, in order to do that, I'm going to be using several very important tools. First is the um, picking stick with which we'll take the larvae out of their dishes. Um, next, very importantly, is the um, dissecting forceps, um, which need to be extremely sharp in order for the dissection to go forth. Um, then we'll be using a surgical blade, number 11 surgical blade, to remove the discs from the head. And then we'll be placing the discs on a slide um, with some VectaShield um, as our mounting media. So the first thing we're going to do is collect some third instar, wandering third instar larvae. I'm just using my picking stick here to sort of pry them off the side of the vial. Sometimes it helps if your stick is a little bit wet and then put them into a drop of PBS. Okay, so here we have our third instar larva. Because I'm right-handed, I'm going to turn his head towards my right. And we're going to use a couple of landmarks to uh, guide us as to where to grasp him. First is the main part of the trachea here and here. And then there's a little cross section up here towards the head. So first, I'm going to grab.